India is the platform of God's glory to the nations of the world. If India is a platform of God's glory to the nations of the world, then Mumbai is the gateway for the revival. You and I, we have the privilege to know Jesus. We have the privilege to know God as our Savior. We have the privilege to live a life of full of abundance. We have the privilege of knowing that God has a plan and purpose to make us and to break us. But there are 22 million people in our city who are struggling with sin, who are struggling with issues of life. They're living a situation, a challenge where they're not able to overcome. They have power that holds them back. You and I have the privilege to share the good news. The scripture says, go therefore and preach the good news. You and I, we have a mandate from above. No matter who you are, no matter which background you come from, we are all ordained in Christ Jesus. If you know Jesus in your life as your Lord and personal Savior, then you have ordination from above. You have the Holy Spirit. And you and I, we have the privilege to share the good news with the people of the city of Mumbai and India. Day after day, you can be an instrument. Your eyes can be His eyes. Your mouth can become His mouth. Your hand can become His hand. Your feet can become His feet. Your body is the temple of the Holy Spirit. You become a container of God's glory. I have been doing it for the last 36 years. In this city, in this nation, and I have seen tens of thousands of people turning their hearts to Lord Jesus. You have the privilege. Let's live a life, a life that is worthy of cause. One life will live. Let's live it with full potential. You and I, we have this great mandate from above as an ambassadors of Christ, as a joint heirs of God, to share the good news of Christ Jesus to the people around us. You and I can be an instrument to bring the good news of Jesus week after week, day after day. You can go out on the streets, you can visit hospitals, you can go wherever in your neighborhood and share the love of Jesus. Jesus came that you and I can have eternal life. God bless you.